Good morning, gents. This is going to be a little bit different of a video today because uh, I'm going to put some new products to the ultimate test. Ministry of Supply has sent me some of their socks for review, and uh, the ultimate way that I could think of reviewing these is to put them up against some standard socks. So here we have your standard Ralph Lauren dress sock, and in here we have Ministry of Supply performance socks. The way that I thought about testing this is I'm going to go through my daily routine wearing one Ralph Lauren dress sock, one Ministry of Supply sock, and the, the most qualified person to uh, evaluate whether or not something smells uh, is either a dog or a pregnant woman. So at the end of today, uh, it's going to be a blind smell test with the dress sock, the Ministry Supply sock, and I'm going to tell you about how it feels all day. So I'm going to bring you with me through my daily routine, and we're going to see how these socks play out. So let's open these up and get started because it is now 5.02, and I've got to get going. This is the Atlas Dress Sock. You can check that out there. Uh, and let's get going. So far it feels very weird. I don't think I've ever had socks above my ankle when I go running. And uh, right now I don't have enough light to film you. Not bad. We get uh, seven and a half miles, about an hour, and uh, my feet feel pretty weird. Let's go check them out. Sometimes I have to catch up on work before I go into work. I've been working with German clients and I started working, what, four hours ago? Uh, but now it is 6.40 and I'm behind schedule. Let's 6.45, now I am behind schedule. So far I have not pulled up, adjusted, or fixed either of these socks. They're both pretty much in the same position as when I started running, which is pretty sweet. My left foot definitely feels better. Uh, more kind of airflow. They stick to my foot a little bit better. Uh, my feet were kind of sliding around the cotton socks just as you would in a dress sock if, if you were running. This is a little bit exaggerated of a stress test, but this is the only time today that I'm going to remove the socks in order to take a shower, and then I'll put them back on the same feet afterward. This 
it's definitely the slowest part of my morning routine, but you don't get any better shave than this. Now, this is still my original uh, first straight razor. This is a Dovo Solingen made in Germany blade with a plastic handle. I'm getting a little rust over here, as you might be able to see, but if there's a company out there that has a better razor than this and you want to talk, uh, shoot me an email. Get a few rogue hairs. Ah. Still rocking that Mac Weldon. My typical sort of gentleman's rule of thumb is to have some coordination between my shirt, my socks, and to some degree my pants. But with this experiment, that's totally out the window, and I'm gonna go a little more casual for the office today. A little behind schedule, but doing all right. There's a link in the description to sign up. I'm giving away all five of these 5-4 Club packages to people that are on that list. And if you're a subscriber already, thank you. If you have come to this video for the first time, please subscribe to keep videos like this coming. And if you want to win one of these five packages, sign up in the link below. Let's go to work. So far, my right foot feels very odd and my left foot feels incredibly comfortable. The way that the Ministry of Supply socks have more of a compression feel to them, uh, they kind of fit better, they have better form to them. On my right foot with the Ralph Lauren sock, I definitely have more of a sweaty feel uh, and more of an uncomfortable feel in the shoe. And on my left side with the Ministry of Supply sock, uh, complete moisture wicking, sweat wicking, and temperature control feels a lot better on my left foot right now. It is now uh, 8.15 in the morning, just got to work, gonna see how it goes through the day. You gotta stay hydrated. I drink four of these hydro flasks every day and uh, there's nothing better than having a bunch of water every day and having plenty of excuses to run to the bathroom. Almost 14,000 steps, not a bad day. I try and go for 10,000 steps every single day in order to you know, stay fit and stay active. So even on a day where I wouldn't have run in the morning, I still try to walk as much through the workday as I can on lunch, taking quick breaks. So today, racked up almost 14,000 steps, including my run this morning. So pretty normal day. My left foot with the Ministry of Supply sock definitely felt more comfortable throughout the day. I'm really interested to see if either of them have a smell or, or feel that way through them. I'm definitely going to wear the Ministry of Supply socks for a few more days just so I have them on both feet to give you a better idea of how they feel. But so far, really liking the way they feel just wearing them throughout the day.
make sure you switch them up in your hands. All right, sock number one. Okay. Wave for light. Okay. Sock number two. Okay. Okay, already this one feels way wetter. Which one? This one. Like, way right here, it's wetter. But this one feels kind of like wet too, but this is wetter. Yeah, this one just feels wetter. Okay, let's go. I was like, the higher I got, the worse it smelled. Okay. 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 This one smells like a carpet, and this one smells like wet dog. So. There you have it, gents. I hope every guy finds a woman that loves you enough to smell your dirty socks the moment you take them off your foot. The Ministry Supply sock did extremely well compared to the cotton dress sock that we tested today. A note about this Ralph Lauren sock is that while it's not completely brand new, I've only worn this pair once and I did wash them before wearing them. So just a note on that comparison. Overall, that was 13 hours of wear today between the run and the work day. I did wear the Ministry of Supply socks for the balance of the week in order to get a feel for how they perform on a regular day. And I have to say it's gonna be tough to go back to a normal cotton dress sock after these incredibly comfortable and very breathable socks. While doing more research into the Atlas sock this week, I learned that it's 40% coffee infused recycled polyester, 40% cotton, and 20% elastane. That combination is what gives it the odor reduction, the form-fitting feel, and the breathability as well because it has a very interesting stitching, which they talk about on their website. At $15 a pair, you're not gonna replace your whole sock drawer with these, but to have an extra pair or two on hand for a long work day, an extra hot day, or one where you're traveling a lot, that's going to be invaluable. That is the Atlas Dress Sock from Ministry of Supply. If you have any questions about these socks or the company, you can comment below or reach out at the underscore Cavalier on Twitter and Instagram. If you decide to buy anything from Ministry of Supply, if you use my link in the description below, that lets them know you came from me and it lets me know that you found this video helpful and it also supports my channel, so I really appreciate it. Make sure you subscribe to my channel to keep videos coming about the best menswear on the internet. If you know anything about my uh, Mack Weldon obsession, you know that the Mack Weldon dress socks are my absolute favorite, so stay tuned for when I do a comparison between the Mack Weldon dress sock and the Ministry of Supply. I think that one will be interesting. And lastly, you can comment below or hit me on Twitter. Uh, let me know what you think about this vlog format. I really wanted to try something new for this video and uh, taking four hours of footage down to what I got it to, which is about 10 minutes, is quite the challenge. So very good on Casey Neistat for the work he does. Uh, it's, it's no secret that he does an incredible amount of work on his videos and uh, firsthand experience with that today. Thank you for supporting my channel so far. If you know somebody you think would like this video, please send it to them. And until next time, gents, this is Cavalier.